can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. So V launches Bitcoin staking token on Solana. Solana price bearish triangle hits at a 40% drop. Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. In this video, we'll be taking a look at an altcoin in the cryptocurrency market. Solana currently trading above $153. Solana has a market cap of $72 billion. The last one year since Solana rally up by more than 472%. How high can Solana go in the coming days and the coming weeks? Are the wheels dumping on us? Should we be very, very bearish on the price of Solana? Can we see a 40% dump before the end of the year? Or is Solana shooting for the $200 level? Guys, right now, there's great in the cryptocurrency market. Market participants are getting excited. Just last week, there was fear in the market. We were expecting a big dump to Goblin Town. There was panic front left and center. Right now, this greed back in the cryptocurrency market right now. Meme coins are taking over again. Meme coins are pumping. But this time around, there's a difference in the meme coin that are pumping. Yes, we have seen some Solana meme coins still taking charge. There's PopCard pumping. There's GigaShot pumping. But guys, I've noticed the trend that most of the meme coins pumping right now are Ethereum meme coins. And another troubling sign for the altcoin market is that Bitcoin dominance hit a 3.5 year high as altcoin gets left behind. Bitcoin market share near 60% is highest level since April 2021, while all coins were muted in the last 24 hours. Solana is one of those all coins. Solana has pumped crazily in the last two years. We have seen Solana go from as low as $8. Solana was trading $8 in 2022 December. And those believers in Solana, those people that bought the dip in the depth of the bear market, they were rewarded for their courage, they were rewarded for their patience because Solana has got into as high as $210 in 2024. But guys, when the prices are going high, when we start shooting to the moon, that's when retail comes in. Majority of us in the market are retail. That's when a lot of people start shilling Solana, start buying Solana, start gambling on Solana, start buying meme coins on Solana. We saw Solana price stagnate at the $210 level. And since the first week of March, we have been moving sideways. Since then, we've seen Solana go back to as low as $110. Right now, Solana trades at the $150 level. Solana has been trading in this 45% range. Now, I believe majority of market participants are very bullish on Solana. Meme coins on Solana are still pumping. Solana has seen an 8.7% increase over the last one week, pumping by 16.2% over the last one month. The market is still very bullish. They're still Nice sentiment in the market. Greed has returned back to the market. But guys, you have to be asking yourself this million dollar question. If you bought at the bottom, if you bought at $10, if you bought at $8, even if you bought Solana at $30 and you're up 500% on your initial investment, will you be selling right now for some sweet, sweet profit or will you be adding more to your bags? Remember, we're always going to see a bear market in the cryptocurrency market. And the fact that we didn't blast to new all time highs was a very, very telling sign because. I just want to believe that somebody that has enough supply has been selling for the last six months, for the last nine months, and that's why we have been unable to blast to new all-time highs. Yes, there's that alternate scenario that will continue pumping to new higher prices. I will see Solana pumping over $250. But guys, if you take a look at Solana's performance against Ethereum, Solana's performance against Ethereum is telling. It has been pumping to higher values as has outperformed Ethereum this cycle, but since the first week of January 2024, we have been stuck at the 0.056 ratio level. We have seen Solana even pop to new all-time highs briefly in August of 2024 when that crash happened. But right now, I think we'll see Solana dumping back against Ethereum. That might mean Ethereum pumping and Solana not pumping as hard as Ethereum. That might mean Solana dumping, Ethereum not dumping as hard as Solana. But one thing is sure, I think we'll be heading back to Goblin Town against Ethereum. And if you take a look at Solana's performance again against Bitcoin, we have been going sideways. Distribution has been happening over the last nine months. Since we got to 2022, the trade was already over. Market participants were already, uh, they already started shouting Solana to the moon. And that's when we started going sideways. The main trade was when everybody was bearish Solana. The whole of 2023, Solana rose 430 460% against Bitcoin. Since we entered 2024 and Solana has been the talk of the town, it has basically just been going sideways. Most people that bought Solana in the last nine months have just been exit liquidity. But it's not all bad news, guys. There's still some good news. So V launches Bitcoin staking token on Solana, Bitcoin Imagine Layer 2, and DeFi ecosystem as parking competition for BTC liquidity 
on other chains. The Sofi protocol has launched a Bitcoin staking token on Solana in a bid to woo BTC holders as a yield opportunity profit for digital currency slow. Uh, Solana's price might not be pumping as hard as other coins. Solana's price might not be pumping as hard as meme coins that are even on the Solana network. There might be reasons for that. Most meme coins on the network are flashing red and market participants want to go where there's profit. The reason why they went to Solana it was because it was a profit. There was a huge, huge rise in Solana. Basically, anybody that bought memes in Solana when Solana was $20, it's automatically their memes went up 5x, 6x, 7x. That created the wealth effect that some meme coins on Solana pumping. Right now, we are seeing most of those meme coins cool down and market participants are slowly realizing that they're getting rocked. Pump.fun was good. But guys, majority of people that bought tokens on Pump.fun were rocked. And we've seen activity on the Solana network actually tanks. That's further proving that meme coins were driving the activity. So when those meme coins are not pumping, what happened to activity? Activity will go down. And if price was going up because activity was increasing, and you see activity reducing, what do you expect to happen to price? I think eventually price will go down. And this analysis is saying Solana price bearish triangle hints at a 40% drop. And the 40% drop for where we are currently trading right now, guys, we see Solana heading back towards 50. It's towards $75. When I go below $110, the $110 level was where Solana was trading back in August when we saw that Japanese yen trade dump to Goblin Town. Right now, a 40 plus percent dump will carry Solana towards the $75 level. You have to ask yourself this question Are you ready for a 45 percent pullback in the price of Solana? You want to buy fear in the market, you want to sell greed. Right now, there's greed in the cryptocurrency market, and greed is always a good time to sell. Greed is a good time to let go of your bags and get some liquidity. Guys, the number one job you have to do in this market is to buy low and to sell high. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. How high do you think Solana will go in the coming days and the coming weeks? If we are truly in a meme coin cycle, when the meme comes to per cycle, how high do you think Solana price will go? Can we get to new all-time highs? Solana will be the new casino that most of these meme coins will be traded on. How high will the price go? But if we are getting to the end of this cycle and we have been seeing distribution happen for the price of Solana over the last nine months, over the last nine months, we might be dumping to Goblin Town. How low do you think that dump will go? Drop talked about that in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notifications to get notified anytime I drop a new video and anytime I go live. Remember guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. Invest for the long haul. Don't get too scared. Don't get too greedy. See you guys in my next video. Remember, all I'm offering is the truth. Nothing more.